I was shopping for a vintage dresser, but everyone I liked was costing upwards of $800. And these Ikea dressers usually retail for $249 brand new. But I found this one on a 50% off day at a local thrift store for only $35. And that's when I thought I could probably flip this to look like a vintage dresser. So first I numbered each drawer so they fit back into the right opening. Then sanded down the drawers and dresser with 80, 120, and 200 grit sandpaper to leave a really smooth finish. Then I glued on these trim pieces that I got at Lowe's and I just mitered the ends with these mitering shears so it had a seamless frame-like edge around the border of every drawer, but leaving enough room so the drawers would still close. Next, I added on some mid-century inspired tapered legs, plus this Minwax Provincial stain that I think makes it look really worn and rich with history. Finally, I added these really minimal brass knobs that gave this dresser the personality that it needed. I absolutely love the way that it turned out and only ended up spending under $100 in total. Click the link in the comments for a detailed step-by-step -step process and subscribe for more videos like this.